Hi, in this video, we will talk about the differences between if then else and if else statement. Suppose we have a tabular data named student info. It consists of a column student ID and their respective height and weight. We want to add another column in this table which will show me the ratio of height and weight of each student. But we have set some specific rules to calculate this ratio which are if weight is less than equal to 10 then divide height by 10 or else if weight is greater than 10 then divide height by weight. If not then if weight is not applicable then return NA. We will write two codes to divide each element as first one using if then else statement and will create a column named ratio and in another code we'll use if else and will create a column ratio 1. First we'll take the example of if then else statement. When we execute this code R throws a warning saying that the condition has length greater than 1. It is so since we are comparing a set of values against integer 10, not a single value. Let's view the results. As you can see in ratio column, values are simply height by weight. It looks like we had not imposed any condition to calculate this ratio. The result is like this because if then else structure takes only single value in its condition part. As we impose a condition on weight which consists more than one value, if then else structure will only take first element into account. In this case, first value is 13 which satisfies the if condition. Therefore, R executes the if part for all the elements. Let's write another code using if else. When we execute this, it will add another column ratio 1 in our data. Let's view the result. You can see that if else takes each element of weight column separately. You can see that if else take each element of weight column separately to check the condition and then execute if part when condition is true, otherwise executes the else part. If else is vectorized operation, while if then else is not. 